what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so it looks like we have a bit of, bit of changes going on regarding i first want to talk about the changes looking like we have in place for screen 5's production start date as you see here from instagram from kara b still now i believe her name is kara mcgee she's the script supervisor of screen 5 look at the very bottom of this comment section um when asked when filming will begin it says october 1st she replied back to this fan no it's going to begin this month now if filming is supposed to begin this month the issue a lot of people are having is where is sydney prescott not only that but where is the rest of our cast and if filming is supposed to start this month one thing is for certain we should expect more casting to more casting updates not only come out possibly by the end of this week but a full casting announcement a full cast sheet revealed by no later than before september 30th if if, if indeed it is going to start this month uh, of course before september 30th so we have a lot to look forward to when it comes to that and this other this fan that commented that what they also commented was just asking about what's going on you know with nev campbell and her involvement with the project because we know we have david arquette we have courtney cox we have jenna ortega we have melissa barrera we have jack quaid um we have our three new our three newbies and we have our two our two-thirds of the original trio back still don't know about nev campbell still don't know about kirby reed hayden pantier still don't know about a lot of things regarding this film um so that same fan that asked about the production starting and we found out that it's going to start this month and not october as i've previously been stating on this channel and as it was reported actually because it said it was supposed to start um around not re it wasn't reported it was on like the production listings and all those production sites it had october october 15th october 1st so they also asked about nev campbell and the response kara mcgee gave was to the effect of you know we have a script in place that we already have a script in place and we know what characters are already going to be involved we know who and what already based off of this script that we intend to use and as far as nev campbell her contract has not even been her contract had been finalized or had not been finalized and she hasn't even signed on yet so like she still hasn't signed on even though there's a contract being finalized right now as we speak for her and then her all her her response continued stating if she isn't going to be coming back script rewrites can be done prior to filming starting now i don't think that karen mcgee has just flat out come out here and just told us that there's a chance that nev campbell might not come back of course there is a chance she might not come back but what i think is happening is we're now in the stage of events where productions nearing everyone involved with this project if you're going to be bombarding them with questions they've probably been they've probably been told from those above them to reply in this manner when it comes to nev campbell you know kind of play around beat around the bush don't be too direct kind of just get people talking and make them doubt that she'll come back when in fact we know that she possibly is 100 percent already on board given that her name is listed on the production weekly site not only there but it's on these all these other production listings and being quite honest when it comes to these sites like that i have yet to be like failed by them when it comes to casting when it comes to casting and things regarding 100 percent concrete infinite or information regarding projects that those websites in particular they've never failed me uh definitely have some ties to what's going on with the project since you have parkside alpha as the working title and then we come to find that parkside alpha is a thing and there's audition tapes nev campbell being on the production production weekly list that's not for nothing she's she's signed on and if she hasn't if for some reason she decided to back out i'll find that more believable than just her never have been signed on at all i found i find that absolutely absurd what i could see happening is if she's not involved by the by the time filming starts according to the production weekly list she was at least in talks as we know she stated that herself and then according to that that listing i'm gonna be under the assumption if she's not in the film that she at was one point under contract to return but they have still been negoti negotiating other things about it given 
her role in the franchise, how 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 imperative Sidney Prescott is to the narrative, and how they want to honor Wes's legacy, and all of these other things. We have Kevin Williamson back as an executive producer. I don't really think Kevin Williamson being back and the two thirds of the trio being back is necessarily evidence that Nev herself is back. Those two individuals, David and Courtney, and Kevin Williamson, who is the creator of this universe they would love to just be back with or without nev at this point and that's my honest opinion on it they would love to have her back but they don't need nev to you know come and have fun doing what they enjoyed about the other movies they love making screen movies they want to honor wes's legacy and the fact that so many people bombarded care mcgee about it i don't think she's gonna come out here and tell you like yeah you know uh we have a we have a script in place that we want to use it most she didn't say it features sydney but that's probably most likely a script that features sydney but if script rewrites need to occur then you know we have those in place already or we're, we definitely can do that before filming starts i don't think you're going to do that before filming starts i think you've done that i think there's multiple scripts already written up in case sydney prescott nev campbell says you know what f this project i don't like what you guys are doing i don't think you're honoring wes's legacy the right way and i don't want any parts of this nothing wrong with that whatsoever if she's not back that's fine by me and when i say that's fine not to say that i'm not going to miss the character of sydney prescott I'm saying that's fine in the sense that, you know what, we could have still at the end of the day gotten something that that's far worse. We could have gotten a movie that is not canon with the other movies. We could have gotten something that is just retconning everything. We could have gotten, we, we might actually begin that because again, we don't have an official word that this is going to be picking up from screen forward. Uh, we could have gotten something that retcons everything or we could have gotten a remake could have gotten a lot of other things we could have gotten filmmakers that were not passionate about the project we're not fans of west craven they're just looking to make a, a big name for themselves we don't have any of that we have a, a team of people who have stated multiple times that they're here to try to honor west's legacy and get, do their own spin on it kevin williamson has praised what they've come up with and i'm assuming this involves nev campbell sydney prescott if she is not back in the film i don't know what to think other than the fact that either she didn't want to risk something regarding possibly this pandemic or she just did not fully she just doesn't want to fully commit because of wes or she's just not as satisfied with the material as what she made it out to be when she said they, they were in talks um i'm i'm very confident that she is definitely back i'm confident that she will be on screen again as cindy prescott in what capacity probably a much smaller one because again we are supposed to be focusing on a character named sarah and her sister Teresa and her friends annie ryan uh mod all of these other characters that i've talked about and several other people have talked about in their channel or on their channel due to the casting sheet leak and the audition tapes that we all gained access to a few weeks ago it's very obvious that nev campbell more than likely is back the answers that you're going to get from people involved with the project are going to be answers to throw you off and make you doubt. Now, why exactly they would let Kara McGee come out there and, you know, let's say, you know what? Uh, she's not in the project. Her contracts, this, that and the other, unless that's like something doesn't seem right to me because honestly if you're this involved in the project would you even talk about something like a like a star's contract like that would you even talk about that i don't because a casting agent the casting agent for the project i tried reaching out to them they wouldn't tell me anything so why is a script supervisor allowed to talk about stuff like this unless the the agenda's changed and now we're just at the stages where okay well if they ask you about nev they've been instructed to give replies like this you know beat around the bush plant these seeds of doubt it's very much obvious it's very obvious to me anyway that she indeed will be back if she's not back so be it it just seems blatantly obvious that at this point we're all being dragged by the uh dragged by the collar or we're hanging on by a thread to get that announcement of nev campbell and it's coming it's going to come i believe it and i feel it when you ask someone in the film who especially a script supervisor when a casting agent told me they wouldn't say anything that was weeks ago though so the new agenda might be you know if they ask about certain things beat around the bush and don't give any direct replies they didn't say that nev campbell wasn't going to be back they just talked about a, a, a contract being written up and as of yet 
she hasn't signed on is what it sounded like and if if she doesn't we have plans already we can make plans for her lack of involvement but the intent is to do a movie with her in it they're just beating around the bush they're trying to plant seeds of doubt i don't see how kara mcgee would come out here and just tell you like flat out you know what yeah she's not gonna be in it. she might be in it like honestly she probably would have just said she's not gonna be in it if she wasn't gonna be in it honestly if she's allowed to say that she would have said it but she did it i think she's gonna be back we all need to stop worrying about it if you haven't already make sure you subscribe turn on post notifications that you never miss a video in the description i have links to my social media accounts my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there to let me know if there's any movies news or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future with all that in mind guys i will see you in the next video